Hey gentlemen, welcome back to my channel and in today's video my friends I'm gonna talk about money. Do you need money to get girls? How important is money? And in today's video I'm gonna tell you the truth about money, how money works and how it works especially in dating and how to use it to get more girls. So let me tell you a story about a friend and a former client of mine. So I had a client and he's 40 years old now. He's been building his business pretty much all his 20s. He's been selling things online and from his basement he started his career as an entrepreneur and he's been selling shoes and he's been growing his business to a multi-million dollar company. And then he was living the dream, he was living in Thailand in the winter when it was cold in Germany, he grew up in the east of Germany and when he came back to Germany he never had any girls and he never worked on his social skills so he was always afraid of talking to women. He was speaking with filters, he had social anxiety and it was generally really hard for him to socialize and to make friends and therefore he never had a lot of girls and never the girls that he actually wanted. So that's why he started to work with me and then he became better with this but on his own he never made it until he was 40 years old and it was really hard for him to get with girls. Even if he was rich, he even bought a Lamborghini but he never was the social guy and the cool guy and the bad boy that gets the girls. Then I have another friend that is not making so much money, maybe has like two, three, four thousand euros a month and he's traveling the world every day or every week or month another country and he's dating a lot of girls just because he's working from the morning from nine to five and after he has time to get girls and in the last 15 years he built the social skills that he needs to get along with girls, to flirt with girls and to just have a great dating life. So it really depends on your lifestyle setup, how you use money and how you structure your life but it really comes down to the social skills, the confidence and the charisma in the end. So just because you have a lot of money it's not sure that you are dating a lot of attractive girls. So let's start with me explaining you how to use money and how it works in dating. Let's start with money as an excuse. Next to the myth that you have to look good, that you have to have high status and that you have to be super rich and famous to get girls, money is just another excuse by normal guys because they don't take the action and build the social skills and become the man that is able to attract women. That's why they say, oh without money, without looks, without status, you can't get girls. So first you have to drop all the excuses about money. And I've been there, I've done that, I used my looks as an excuse because I can't get any girls until I finally take action. But on the other hand side, number two, money should also not be an issue. So if you're going on a date with a girl and you're trying to split the bill and you're trying to not spend as much money or you're always looking how much money you spend, then that's also not good because you should go out with a girl without any worry about money and if you don't have a lot then maybe make more so you don't have to split the bill that you can go out for nice dinners or when you're dating a girl for a longer time that you can do trips or that you can just do cool things. I personally don't spend a lot of money on girls until I've been sleeping with her. Most of my first dates are just getting a smoothie or a coffee or having drinks at a nice normal or maybe higher class bar. But it really depends on the frame it's coming from. Because if you're trying to use money to impress the girl or to make everything right for her or just to show her that you have money and you want her to like you for that or you're trying to impress her then that's not gonna work because she will look through you and think okay he's not worth it he only thinks that I like him for his money and then she will not respect you and also not treat you the way that you want it. If you want to spend money on a girl, if you want to buy her nice things, if you want to invite her for dinner or for a nice steak or if you're going somewhere anyways and you take her with her and she's maybe from Russia or from Argentina 
or from any country where the girl is not having so much money or she doesn't have a job or she's a student, then you have to think, do I want to pay for her drink 10, 20 bucks, whatever that you're spending on her? Or do you want to be the greedy guy that doesn't have $20 to pay for her drinks when she can't afford it? It's your mission as a man to invite the girl out on a date. And if you invite her and you don't pay for her drinks, then I think that's not a good thing because you as a man should be doing that. You invite her out and you pay for her drinks and you are the leader on the date. Number three, so what I would do is that I use money to leverage a great lifestyle. So for example, if you're hosting parties, if you're hosting social events and you're buying the food and you're buying the drinks and then you invite girls and tell them to bring your friends, then it's a lot easier to meet a lot more girls at the same time. And yes, you have to spend some money. So I would not spend money on girls directly to pamper her like crazy when she's not like your long-term girlfriend and she likes you and loves you and is trustworthy and loyal. But I would definitely use money as a lifestyle. For example, sometimes we go to a VIP high-end beach club and we spend some money on bottles and we invite some girls and then it's just convenient if the girls don't have to pay for anything. Also because they don't make as much money or they can't afford it, but they just like to be in the high society or just be cool in the VIP area and enjoy their life without even having to worry about money. So what you can do is that you use money to run social circle events, that you throw parties, that you invite the girls on trips that you're going to anyways, that you, for example, when you're traveling, that you take her with you, that you can just say, hey, Linda, do you want to come with me and we go to Spain or we go on a hiking trip or something and you just tell her, hey, come with me, I pick you up in my car and then you can take her there. So that shouldn't be an issue too much. And you have to think that you pay for girls or for dates with your time anyways. And then it depends on how much you're making at your job, at your business or whatever. It depends how much money you want to spend. But I don't think it's a problem to spend a little bit of money on girls if she likes you, if she's treating you well and if she gives you a great time with her feminine energy. So use your money to maybe buy an apartment or rent an apartment in the city center so your life is more convenient, to be more comfortable, to have access to places that other people maybe can't go to, to throw parties, to get into VIP areas or to just spend a little bit more money in a restaurant to meet better people and therefore level up your social circle. So money is a thing, you, if money is an issue for you, then you should be working on getting your money up. You don't have to be super rich, definitely it's good. When you are in a job, for example, and you're working from nine to five, then I would definitely use the spare time to build up my social skills, my confidence, and to just become a well-rounded man that you can attract the girls you want and then work on your money in your job, in your career, building the skills and just becoming a high value man. So money is not the only thing. Work on your physique, on your health, on your wealth, on your looks, maximize your looks. But money is not the thing that is holding you back. It's most of the time your excuses and your rationalization because you're seeing the guys popping bottles at the, at the club that they have a lot more money than you and you can't get the girls. Stop using money as an excuse. Make more money, make more friends, game girls, build your social skills and then just live a great life and date attractive women. So if you are interested in working with me and my team and you need help in your dating life, building your social skills, becoming more confident and charismatic, then what I want you to do is that you apply for a free consultation call with me and my team and we are going to call you, find out if and how we can help you analyze your situation, get to know each other and then help you in your dating life give you some tips and make a step-by-step -step plan on how you can achieve your dream social and dating life. Thank you very much for watching. Hit like and subscribe to this channel and then see you in the next video. She just wants to flirt, so I flirt right back. I just put in work, yeah, I work like that.